What's going on guys? It's the Pancake Renegade here and welcome back to Fall 3. We are continuing off in the um the Into the Pit DLC. And uh yeah, I reloaded an old save from like before I got um before I started talking to Everett just cuz I I wanted to like get through this and see if there were any other options. So you're the lucky scab gathering ingots for me today, huh? Yeah. Uh Yep, that's me. Good to see a little enthusiasm for once. Well, follow me. Oh, oh, excuse me. All right, sorry. Um, I did that because I thought there would be a bit more, um, a bit more, uh, what's it called? Uh, like a bit more choices and options so, and stuff. Do your duty, huh? I guess not. Would you piss off to get that death sentence? Actually, don't even tell me. It's not like you'd be alive for long anyway. No, oh, you'd be surprised. Alright, so in here is like his little uh, workshop area, I guess. Can we grab that? No. Alright. Let's go uh, through here. Open the door to the abandoned area. Don't look at me, scab. I'm gonna look at, all you, look at you all at once. Oh. This, uh. See that fella up there? You'll be seeing lots of those. Yeah. And if you survive them. Tell you what, why don't you do me a favor? That way, I don't have to walk so far to meet your corpse, eh? Sorry, I was trying to check Here's out the those creatures. Get out there and grab some ingots. Don't come back without at least ten. Without at least ten. Turn them ten. into me and I'll see if I can slip a little something your way. Alright, sure thing. Do you have anything else to say? I like how the machinery all just stopped for a second. Move on, pissant. All right, let's check these lockers. Empty, of course, of course. Um, let's check these creatures out again. So they seem to be a bit like uh, like ghouls, I guess. Although they're on all fours and they're, I don't know, like a feral ghoul mixed with a frog. So yeah, and a cannibal. Oh, these guys remind me of, um, Volatiles from, uh, Dying Light. If you guys oh, haven't checked out my series on that, then you should. Alright, let's open this door to the steel yard. <clears throat> Water is good. Alright, you have discovered the pit steel yard. Auto saving. All right, let's just make another save on top of that one. <clears throat> there we go. Because auto save is going to get interrupted at some point. So, hold on, my phone's going off. Let's uh, turn that off. All right. Just a message in a group chat. Oh, please reconnect controller. Well, let's try something. Alright, and we are back. I finally found a charger that would work for the controller. Um, my original charger I have, um, it, like, my controller fell off my desk one day, and I guess it, like, broke, and I didn't realize it. So, yeah. Um, anyway, back to the game. If we move on right here, we can find the body of a pit slave with uh, an assault rifle, a couple of uh, 5.56 five, ammo rounds, and these new items called steel ingots. If you can remember, uh, Everett told us to do, or told us to, uh, he said, don't come back unless you found at least 10, and those posts are glitching. All right. Okay. <clears throat> so, I guess uh, what we need to do is find 10, right? So you can really you could just like wander around for a bit and you'll find some eventually. It's me. Your brother John John. You remember me, don't you, Billy? Billy? Hold on, I want to save him. I want to save him. 
Ah, oh, dang it. Come on. Hey! Go, 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 oh, go. Please! Aww. Oh. We got more of these creatures coming up behind us. Alright, let's go ahead and actually use the auto axe we got from uh, Marco. Ooh. Okay. Oh. Okay then. And that's why we have auto saves. And regular saves. So. Yeah. As you can see. Uh, that person tried talking to a trog, and it didn't work so well on their behalf. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this stuff again. Grab more ammo, and those... Actually, what's his DR? Let's grab that. Is it just... It's two, right? Ours is one. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's not what I wanted. Alright, actually, let's do that. Yeah, okay. It's the same thing. For some reason, I was thinking it was different. Anyway, this person is trying to uh, talk to a trog. Billy, it's me, your brother John John. You remember me, don't you, Billy? Hold on, let me just try and uh, <laughs> I'm gonna try and grab a thumbnail for this. Oh yeah, so he missed. I was just gonna follow him back around and whack him. Whoa. Yeah, he's dead. Bye bye. You could have just gone this way, dude. Anyway, let's turn this back on and see what your name was. <clears throat> Pit slave. All right, sure thing. Let's get this auto back. Frog savage, huh? Well, we killed you before we could die. Oh, we're gonna level up. Sweet, sweet. Um, you know, the thing about level ups is that you're supposed to uh, level up. You know, that's, that's the whole thing. It's called a level up for a reason. You, uh, you gain XP and you you've leveled up or you know don't don't do that yeah okay sure let's check under here no all right <clears throat> oh oh this is already well ah dang it okay so this is going to take a bit Take a bit of time. Now let's not worry about um, trying to watch that dude save his brother or whatever. Any longer than we need to. Uh, no reason to see it three times, right? Just take all that. Uh, combine those two. Oh, and actually, let me use this baseball bat. It'll probably won't be as effective, but still, it's something. It's got a logo on it. Hmm. Alright, let's hop in here. No way he's not it's hostile. Me. Your brother John John. <laughs> Your brother John John. Oh, he spoke it. He spoke words. He spoke it. Come on. Ah. Okay. I usually never... <laughs> I usually never have uh, this much trouble with this. I mean, it, it doesn't... What in the world? Why am I struggling so bad? Okay, this is really strange. I'm normally, like, really good at this. It's been a while, so... <laughs> I suppose it'll take some adjustment. Alright, just go ahead and, uh... Billy. Kill this guy. It's me! 
be you sparing with me. their ammo. Don't you Ooh, you hey, we saved you. Pit slave is fleeing. My poor brother. My poor brother. Um. Okay, now let's go with science max and then rest into speech. Uh, we want. Let's see. Action. Bo yeah, let's go. Oh, Billy! You're just gonna. Okay, sure. Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll leave you to it, man. You can, can grieve all you want. Just He was going to kill you, so I figured I'd step in and save you. Save your life. Alright, there's nothing up here. Ooh, I see some. Uh, let's see, can we make this jump? <gasps> yes, we got it. Alright, sweet. So that's what, four, right? Let's check all these. Ooh. Five, six. Check these last two. Or last, sorry. So that's what six in total. Ooh. All right. Seven, eight, nine. Right, let's just uh do that. So we have nine, right? I think we have nine. Let's just double check. Miscellaneous. Yeah, we have nine. Okay. Let's check back here, make sure we're not missing any, make sure none are, like, in between. Alright, we need one more. Any back here? No? Oh. I think that's one. I could be wrong. Like I said, I don't really remember where anything is. Um, like, it's, it's pretty vague in my mind. So I'll have to, uh... I, I don't know where like everything is. I'll have to figure it out all over again, I guess. Oh, okay. Got you. Oh, oh. Let's heal real quick. Uh-uh. Oh. Stop it. It's illegal. That's illegal. Human flesh? No, thank you. Oh, we'll take the take medics. Teddy bear. Hmm. Alright, let's reload. We're running low on ammo. Okay. Ah! Here we go. That's 10. That's 11. Alright, we have worn slave outfit. Agility 1, endurance 1. Yeah, okay. Perk added. Surviving in the steel yard has taught you something about life in the pit. You will now do extra damage with the signature weapon of the slaves. The auto axe. Alright, that's cool. Uh, let's go ahead and return to Medea, although I have a feeling we will be back here at some point. <clears throat> Wait, didn't I just... Oh, Billy. oh, that dude's gonna die. I killed his brother, but, uh... This dude... Wait a minute. Oh, it's behind you. Oh, it doesn't care about you. Wait, are you... <laughs> My poor brother. Are you immune? So, I've never really, like, saved this dude before, right? I've always just, like, watched him die. You know? I know it sounds kind of... Um, morbid. I think that's the word I was looking for. But, uh, yeah. I've always just kind of, like, watched him die. I've never really, like tried saving him i didn't know what would happen but yeah uh let's go back through this abandoned area all right everett nope i guess everett's back up here my nose itches I have to scratch that at some point oh how did you get in here oh and we're out of ammo Oh, bobby pin. Okay. Not the trade I was looking for. But, you know, it'll do. Alright, let's check down here. See if there's any, like, hole or something. <clears throat> let's see what is over here. Alright. Nothing. Great. Thanks. That's wonderful. Ooh. What? 
I see something got through here somehow. All right, let's check this. We're at what eleven, I think. Let's go up here. Come on. All right, you know what? Twelve, thirteen. Wait, what? What's our inventory weight at? We are at thirteen. Forty-one out of two seventy. Come on. Uh. Forty-one. Okay, so these don't weigh anything. Alright. Let's just check this, like the rest of this place. Make sure. Alright, I think we are done here. Yeah. Alright, let's go back to the mill. Turn these into Everett, because he said he might try and slip us something nice. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I believe there are a hundred... Steal you. Well now, look who made it back. They just automatically take some. I'll take those ingots, scab. You just get back in there and get about your business. You got a real knack for this. Here, this might help you work a little harder. Original owner can't use it anymore on account of decapitation. Hmm. Where can I find steel ingots? There should be plenty out in the steel yard, especially higher up in the round buildings. I hear there's a supply plant in the northeast. Should be plenty of ingots in there, too. Here are a few ingots. Looks good. Four steel ingots removed. Uh, is that enough for something? Not right now. Bring in a few more and maybe. Okay, so he uh, gives you stuff every ten steel ingots you bring in. Alright? I think that's how it goes anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how it goes. Okay, so we did that. Oh, wait, he gave us an outfit, didn't he? Laborer. All right, strength plus one, agility plus one, endurance plus one. So it's already better. Has a, a damage resistance of four instead of the hour hour two. Oh, we can repair it with this one. Okay, there we go. All right, sweet. So we got a. I think we look like Marco now. Right? This outfit. Look at her eyes. They look so so strange. Oh, the oh, I just noticed that. Like, look at our look at our neckline. The neckline is way different. Huh. Okay. Well, <clears throat> guess it's time to head back to Medea. Got to move along with this DLC at some point. <laughs> All right, downtown. We've only taken 12 right away? Really? That's surprising to me. I feel like we would have taken a lot more. Do you have anything else to say? Calming philosophy aside, being beaten kind of hurts. Yeah, really? You... Okay. That's... That's a dumb thing to say. Hey, getting physically abused hurts. Where, where, where are you going? What are you, are you gonna whack him? Hey man, I wanna help. What's up? Or someone just shoot. Wait, why do you still have health? Does he still have health? No? Alright, well, I mean, I guess. Huh. Okay, actually, let's take that so we can uh, repair our outfit later on. Are you gonna try and talk to us, Millie? Have you seen Wild Bill around? Who's Wild Bill? Bill's a friend of mine, a very dear friend. We've worked the mill together for a long time. Last week, we were forced to choose someone to gather ingots from the steel yard. Bill volunteered. He didn't want anyone to have to die out there, but he's a survivor. He can't be dead. You look like you can handle yourself. Could you look for him and bring him back? Yeah, sure thing. I'll help you out. Thank you so much. Just be careful out there. Bill would never forgive himself if someone got hurt looking for him. Wait, who's Wild Bill again? I have to go now. 
But I'll keep an eye out for Wild Bill. Good luck. Thanks. She sounded kind of quiet, like as if she was uh, whispering. Well, well, aren't you a tough one? Let's see. Does Medea have any more mail? Nope. All right. Knock, knock, Medea. I'm coming in. Yo, what's up? How's it going? Home. Good. Just in time, Asher has ordered everyone into the square. Rumor has it that he's going to open up the arena. That's perfect for us. Wait, why is that perfect? An arena? Interesting. So that's part of your plan, then? It's simple, really. From time to time, Asher opens up the arena. We call it the Hole. Any slave who wants to can fight against the gladiators. If you win, you get your freedom. More importantly, you get an audience with Asher. It's the only way a slave will ever get to talk to him directly. You fight, you win, and when you talk to Asher, you take the cure. Do I have to kill him to get it? I wouldn't shed a tear, but no. Warner has a distraction planned. We haven't been making these weapons for nothing, you know. But when you're meeting with Asher, you'll be close enough to grab the cure. Get it, and bring it to me. Now let's get out there and listen to Asher's speech. There'll be hell to pay if the guards catch us in here. Yeah, I guess. Sure thing. Citizens of the pit, workers of downtown, traders of uptown, and all fierce souls who do what must be done, I bring you good news. We stand at the dawn of a new golden age, where others merely survive. We thrive! Our industry is the envy of the commonwealth. Our safety is the envy of the capital waste. Our might is the envy of Ronto. And while I have led your efforts, it has been by your own strength that you have earned all the envy of the world. They envy the steel shaped by the workers in our mills. And they envy the strength of our traders and raiders who wield the steel for the pit. And most of all, they envy our victories in the struggle for freedom. Because yes, freedom is what we all work towards. Freedom from fear. Freedom from disease. Freedom to live as once we did before we were shackled by atomic fire. And so, to celebrate this struggle, I ask my loyal workers, who among you is prepared to fight for your freedom? Who among you will risk your life in the crucible to create a new life of freedom in Uptown? Who will take this rare chance to thrive? Come on, Asher. Will you send someone to the hole who actually stands a chance? Very well, Medea. If that is the will of the workers, then this man shall be their champion. Sir, you Wait, carry it, not it's, it's only the dream that workers can become free, but that we may all someday become truly free from the threats of our world. Prepare yourself, sir. And when you are ready to be forged anew, report to Phaedra in the steel mill. The rest of you are dismissed. Phaedra. She sets up the fights. All right, okay. That I mean, that's that's fine by me, but um, nobody else said anything. No one else was like, "Hey, let's go with this person. Let's uh, let's let's cheer this guy on, huh? How about that?" But, like it it was just her. It always smells like that in here. You get used to it. You got anything else to say to me? Watch yourself in the arena. We can't do this without you. All right, so she doesn't have anything else to say. Looks like we should just head to the arena, I suppose. I don't remember how long this DLC is in its entirety, but I can't believe Ash opened up the arena again. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I don't remember how long this DLC is in its entirety, but um, I'm remembering more and more about how this thing works and what all goes down and stuff. And there's another person over here. Oh, there's multiple people. I got 
Yo. What's up? We all knew this was coming, but I don't know. You can take weapons into the hole. It's terrible. Wait. They uh they just sort of whispering. And I wanna I wanna hear what they're saying. I wanna hear what they're talking about. Yeah, good thing I went inside Medea's place, right? I wanna hear what they're talking about, man. I'm curious. Nelly, really, you got anything else to say to me? We're counting on you. You are our best hope. Alright. Sure thing. Man, I can't believe Ash you opened up the arena again. Yeah, neither can I. Well yeah, I don't remember how long this like arena thing lasts for. I think I know what comes after it though. Alright, let's see. I wanna hear what these guys are saying. are coming. Relax. It's just, I'm so ready to do this. We all are. Soon. It'll happen soon. Not soon enough. You got a funny look on your face. You got something you want to say? Asher's got a cure. A cure for what? The plague. We're talking no more drugs. Ever. What? Really? How the hell do you know? You're not the only one with connections. Fine, so spill it already. Or are you just gonna stand there gloating? That's it. He's got a cure. That's it? He's got a cure? You don't know what it is, or where he has it, or what he's planning to do with it? What? That's all I know. It's good intel. You're useless. Let me get those packages. Nothing to worry about. All right, so now it's just repeating. Um, we're talking no more trogs. I was uh, just trying to listen in. Hope you guys uh, understood what they were talking about. Um, the main slave, like leading the whole discussion, he was like asking everyone, "Are you ready for what's coming? Or what's going down soon?" Uh, he's like, "Does everyone have the parts? Uh, we need the parts for the the weapons. We're gonna like, I guess, start something soon." He's like, uh, I've got, someone else said, I've got trusted sources, uh, Asher's got a cure, uh, Werner's back, so, yeah. Let's go, oh, go and interrupt this. Wait. Everything's under control. Better not have screwed up. Yeah, so now he's just asking about packages. So this person whistles, and he's like, the lookout, and everyone else just goes their own separate way. I think that's cool. I've never, like, talk to these people or I've never like overheard that happen oh no <sighs> oh no what I got important news okay so what's up Werner's back yeah okay so he's just saying that Werner's back and it just repeats okay <clears throat> but yeah I, I've never like over um overheard them before I, I apparently haven't done a lot of things in this DLC um but yeah should be fun. Should be fun. Alright, we have to find a, what was it, Shadia? 
think that's what it was. Let's try and talk to Marco real quick, see if he has anything else. Right, we got one radiation a second. So don't stay in the arena too long. Alright. Marco. We all knew this was coming. I don't know. The whole Is it? Really? You just gonna point fingers at machines? What's written on that paper? Blurred stuff. Fun. Well, you have fun with that, alright? I'm gonna go talk to this Shadia or whoever she is. She I think organize yeah, she organizes the fights for the arena. So Alright, I think she's in here. Yeah, okay. Before when we tried opening this gate, it said uh, locked and required a key. See, nothing in there. Nothing in here. <laughs> so you're the dumbass scab that signed up to fight in the hole, huh? Well, head on down. Phaedra's waiting for you. <laughs> Alright, thanks, spook. Got guts galore. Alright. Lots of blood splatter. Jeez, this is reminding me of the uh, reminding me of the um, arena in Oblivion. I presume you were. Phaedra. And what are you doing down here, slave? Don't tell me your pale ass is gonna throw down. Where do I sign up? You don't sign up. You tell me that you want to fight. I set up a fight. You die, and I repeat it with the next jackass slave who comes in here. Sound good? You want in? Come on, death's got to be better than your life, am I right? What are the arena rules? It's pretty simple. When the gates open, you fight. Last one standing wins. Of course, when the gates open, the barrels drop in. So just make sure you kill the other guy before you die of radiation poisoning. You don't want to spend too much time with whatever's in those barrels. Yeah, that's fair. You already look... Like you do without spending time in those barrels, so or with those barrels. So, let's see. Do I get any weapons? You have what you take in with you. But if that's not enough, there are a couple of things in that locker over there. All right. So that's that's a bit of a hint. You know, uh, if you don't have good enough gear, go ahead and raid that locker. I want to fight. Mm, no, 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 no. Uh, tell me about other slaves who have fought in the arena. What's to tell? Most die. Yeah, one or two have made it out, but that's about it. All right. I don't want to say I want to fight yet, because it, like, starts something, I think. I have to go now. Yeah, yeah. Saying that allows you to, like, recoup and regenerate your health and stuff. So there's a locker, apparently. Ah, okay. Um, lead pipe, nail board, .32 pistol, and 24, 30 rounds. 32, uh, 32 rounds? Yeah. All right, let's activate this. And I think we should use a rat away just to get rid of our radiation, because we are going in there. Alright, let's check our radiation. I mean, we should be fine, but, uh... Yeah, I still think it's weird. No one's like, oh, what what in the world is that thing in your arm, huh? Um... Oh, status, right? Yeah. Radiation's 277. All right, let's, uh, oh, okay, so we need to pop that before we go in. Okay, ooh, Rad X, Rad X, empty syringe, no, uh, no Med X, that's a shame. Just cages with bones, skeletons in there. All right, well, this is the rusty gate to the hole. Which is something we would start in the next episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I know this uh, episode has been kind of like a lot of running around and it's been a bit anticlimactic, but nonetheless, I hope you all enjoyed it, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace!